Hello Virgo, this is Renee and welcome back. Virgo, this is going to be your reading for March 2023 in love. So, um, we're going to go over what you can expect, what's coming towards you, um, what's going on in your love life, Virgo. Okay, so if you have Virgo any, anywhere in your chart, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, this reading is for you. Okay. Okay, we have the Ace of Swords, the Empress, the Three of Wands, and the Queen of Swords. Okay, the Lovers. Okay. Beautiful. We have the Star and the Moon. And the Knight of Pentacles. Okay. And Virgo. Your current energy is the King of Wands. So I feel like this is the person who wants to communicate with you. This person is very fiery. Very passionate. Very amazingly handsome. I think this person is fine. Okay. They're very courageous. They're a go-getter, you know. Uh, they may also be an entrepreneur. But I'm feeling like, look how he's just glaring. Like, I want you, you know. I feel like it's very passionate, very loving, very caring, you know. There's a fire behind those eyes. And I feel like it's very magnetic, okay. Um, but I feel like this person is really thinking, they're thinking about how they can step to you. How they can get your attention. You know, what do they have to do to show you that they care? You know, I feel like they, they, there's this attraction between you and this person that's so magnetic. It's like drawing you in. Okay? Um... <laughs> And I feel like there's some sort of communication that they want to relay. Um, they may try to send you some kind of text, some kind of message, maybe on the DM. Um, but I feel like this person finds you just as attractive, just as appealing. Um, we also see this empress as a manifester, a nurturer, you know. Um, this person also may be a mother, may be a father. They may have children, okay. But I feel like with this three of wands energy, I feel like, you know, these feelings are growing. They're like expanding every time you see each other. I feel like, you know, you kind of look in this person's direction or they look in your direction and they can see so many things. I mean, this feeling is so magnetic to me. It's just, I, I feel like, you know, you're deep in thought daydreaming about this person, daydreaming how they would be, how, and I feel like this person is doing the same thing with you. Okay, um, we have the lovers and we have the star. So I feel like this person sees you as something new, something very appealing. Something very energizing, you know. I feel like... You know, this person may see you as a wish come true, as someone very fresh, you know, very new energy, okay? And I feel like there's a lot of mystery to this person. There may be some things that are hidden, some things that you don't know. There's some kind of, and, and I feel like that mystery is more appealing because it's like opening up your curiosity you know and you're ready to like get a move on <laughs>
towards this person even more. But for some reason, Virgo, I can feel that the curiosity is going to get to you before it gets to them. I feel like you're going to be making the first move towards them, Virgo. Because I feel like, you know, although you may have patience, you know, I, I think you see this person as someone who's so mysterious and so exciting that you just want a taste of it, you know? You want to see how this person really, you know, is... I feel like, you know, you're going you're gonna to go beyond this communication phase, this talking, and this man magnetic energy. And you're going to move straight into something that is fire. Okay? <laughs> that's, that's the only way that I can explain it. Um, but I feel a lot of passion when it comes to this person. This person may be a fire sign. They may be a Leo, Aries, or a Sagittarius. Okay. They may be a Pisces. Uh, we also have Aquarius here. Hmm. Very strong energy, though. They could be a Gemini. Okay, we have the Knight of Cups. So this person definitely wants to make you some sort of offer. Some sort of invitation. I feel like this could lead to possibly, you know, a soulmate. You know, something long-lasting. Okay, but they definitely are coming towards you with an offer. This Three of Cups energy. I feel like with this Three of Cups energy, they are here to give you their full support. You know, sometimes with the Three of Cups, I feel this feeling of like a circle of support. You know, like you're surrounded by your soul tribe. Okay, so this could be some sort of soul connection between you and this person. Maybe that's the reason why it's so magnetic. Maybe that's the reason why, you know, you're so drawn to this person, you know, because I feel like, you know, maybe in the past you've had some heartbreak. You've been disappointed, you know, and I feel like you're moving past that energy. You're looking more towards the future, which is happiness. Feeling fulfilled, satisfied, you know, very content. You're walking away from this heartache. And you're walking into this happiness. Okay? Um, so it's very, look at this. We have the Eight of Cups. So you're walking away from this heartbreak. Okay? And you're walking into this King of Cups energy. You know, you're walking into this feeling of support, of being loved. You know, the, the King of Cups, he's very supportive. He wants to take care of your heart. You could be male or female, so I'm not putting any gender on this. I'm just saying what the card is. You know, the King of Cups, this could be male or female. You know, they could carry the characteristics of a King of Cups. But he's very supportive. He wants to take care of you. He wants to take care of your heart. Okay? He's very empathetic to your needs. He knows how to control his emotions. And he comes off very patient and loving, tender. Okay? So I feel like this is beautiful energy for you, Virgo. Okay, let's 
Actually, let's get one more card. What else can we tell Virgo about this situation, Spirit? Give me one more card. The Page of Wands. Fire energy. More fire. This new situation is going to bring a lot of excitement. I feel like once it starts coming towards you, it's going to start coming towards you very quickly. So I feel like it's all going to happen very quickly. Once the ball starts rolling, it starts rolling with momentum, okay? So I, I feel like this offer that's coming in, this love offer here, I feel like you're not going to hesitate. You're definitely not going to hesitate. This is going to be good news to you. Very exciting news. Okay. Whatever this offer is. Whatever this invitation is. So that's beautiful. Okay. Let's get some love cards. For Virgo. Tell me more about this situation. Tell me about this person. Tell me their true intentions. Tell me how they feel for Virgo. Tell me about this person, Spirit. Tell me about this person. Okay. Okay, we have freedom. There's nothing stopping you. The path is clear if you want it to be. So you have the freedom to choose, Virgo. Only time will tell. Okay, free will. Okay. Wait. Don't rush into it. Allow nature to take its course. Okay, so Spirit is letting you know, don't rush. I know you're going to want to, but don't rush. Okay? We have friendship. Nurture the bonds of friendship within your relationship and your love life will dramatically improve. So Spirit is letting you know to get to know this person. Become friends before your lovers. Okay? Okay, let's see. We have acceptance is the key to inner peace. At times we must accept things as they are. There is no point trying to change that which is beyond our control. Okay, so there's someone who needs to hear that message. Okay, and we have sacred union. Honor and treasure your relationship for it's a sacred union. For it's truly sacred. Okay, all right. Let's get a look at... The truth revealed. Tell me what this person wants to say to Virgo. If they could. What would they say to Virgo, please? Give me a message. What would they say to Virgo? Hmm. I feel you even though we're apart. I love you unconditionally. Wow. Finding out the truth crushed me. Maybe they heard that you were not available. Or maybe they heard something. Something. Hmm. Someone needs to hear that message. Okay. We will be together again. And I am afraid to contact you. Um, yeah, so hopefully that resonates with you. Uh, but it seems like there's a few messages in here that really feel like maybe someone else's energy. But it, I mean, it could be the same person's energy. It could be some kind of situation that you dealt with. Um, when you last met them or it could be someone coming in from the past but I don't think so this feels like a new energy this, this feels new okay give me a message for Virgo 
Okay, we have the sword and the rose. So, like I was feeling, I feel like this person wants to protect you. This person wants to, you know, reveal some kind of truth. They want to, you know, get something off their chest, tell you how they feel. Um, I feel like they may feel strongly than what you think. You know, we have welcoming love, meeting the one, soulmate connection, okay? Heart with a key, getting together, a perfect union, okay? So this is beautiful energy for you. At the bottom we have kisses, unconditional loving, giving and receiving affection, and falling in love. So someone definitely wants to be your soulmate. Virgo. So this is this is really interesting energy. Let's get one more message. One more message for Virgo, please. What does Virgo need to know? Okay. There is something that you will be letting go of. But your situation will improve. Hmm. Another message, please. Helpful people. There's going to be someone around you who provides you some sort of help, some sort of guidance. You know, or you may be the person that's helping someone. Okay? We have big, happy changes. So, there's going to be some change. And we have listened to your intuition. Okay? So that is what I have for you, Virgo. So if this reading resonates, please like and subscribe. Hit that bell so that you don't miss any uploads. And take a look at your sun, moon, and rising for more clarity. I have all of the March readings up. So if you want to take a look at your sun, moon, rising, and your Venus sign, that will give you more messages and may clarify things even further. Okay, so until your next reading, many blessings to you, Virgo. Love and light.